towers to protect a village, Kaiping, Diaolu and villages. The town of Kaiping is in the Pearl River Delta in Guangdong Province, southern China. It's surprising to see many tall buildings in this quiet rural area. A total of 1,833 tower houses, known as Diaolu, are found in several villages in this area. This one is decorated with elegant Baroque designs. Another is inspired by Islamic architecture. And medieval European style is also a source of inspiration. Most of these diaulus were built at the beginning of the 20th century. They were built by wealthy people from the area when they returned after making their fortunes in North America and Australia. The furniture inside the high-rise buildings shows how comfortably they lived. Some people still live in the Diaolu. Sometimes several generations living together. This was the current resident's great-grandfather who went to America to support his family when he was young and built there Di Aolu when he returned. He incorporated the symbols of wealth he saw overseas into the design of the building. This style of home is unusual in a village setting, but they have a practical function. These villages are situated in a low-lying delta area and therefore susceptible to flooding. So the Diaolu were built as refuges during the summer monsoon period. Diaolu had another important role. They were also used to protect villagers from attack during an unstable period in the early 20th century. War broke out between China and Japan in 1937. Kaiping became a battleground and many people fled abroad. When the war ended, peace returned to Kaiping and its surrounding area. And with the new era, which began for China, the Hai Diaolos were no longer in vogue. Their place on the World Heritage List is recognition of their historical and constant value.